hello guys um good morning and welcome to crypto airdropper so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how you can set up your pi mobile wallet and your pi browser all right um like um several weeks ago i shared with you guys this video that's the three free cryptocurrency tokens you should be mining now i made a video on the cryptocurrencies you should be mining now so and one of them was the pi network a lot of you guys must have heard of pi network and it was it's estimated to be worth about 200 dollars once it's listed a lot of people are mining pi network so if you're one of those people mining pi network um in this video you learn how you can set up your mobile wallet right so they just finished testing the mobile wallet on on pc right now they're they're, they're trying to test the mobile app as the mobile wallet app all right so i will be showing you how you can do that in this video so but before we get into the video um i love for you guys to take like five seconds to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell icon beside it to turn on notification so that whenever i drop a new video you'll be notified immediately and make sure to check out my previous videos too on airdrop tokens and ways to make money online and there's this lucrative way you can accumulate free accumulate a lot of bnb in a short while as you know bnb is now over four hundred and eighty thousand dollars no, sorry sorry about that over four hundred and eighty dollars all right which and like if you remember months ago bnb was just 40 something 50 something dollars but right now it's over four hundred and eighty dollars all right so it's not too late to join on the moving train because i know like because cryptocurrency is the next big thing all right so a lot of people are making money off cryptocurrency so don't miss out on this opportunity you can check out this video on join my telegram telegram channel where you can see a presentation on foresight all right so foresight is to be is to be launched today but right? don't miss out on this okay so let's get into the video so what i want you for you guys to do is you go and open up your pie all right that's the first thing you do right so i know a lot of you might know might just skip out on this video or maybe skip the whole video but i advise you don't do that so that you don't miss out on anything all right as you can see pi browser with mobile wallets all right so now i'll be showing you how to once you open up your buy your pi to so what you do is you click on pi browser so some of you might not see this pi browser so what you do is you click on the top left hand corner these three white lines you click on it once you click on it then you click on pi browser right well if it's here on your home page on your dashboard page just click on pi browser so once you click on pi browser this something like this will come up so when this comes so you click on sign into pi browser and we will redirect you to where you're supposed to download the pi browser right so it will redirect you to to the pi browser page asking you to download it either from your play store or from your app store all right so what you do is you do that okay so let me pause this all right so let me pause this while this downloads so so once it's done downloading you open up the app okay you click on open so you open up the app all right so you open up the app so just it does stick with me all right so um if you understood to this point please hit the subscribe button and click the like button to like the video and don't forget to drop a, a very interesting comment or if you have any problem if you face any problem setting it up you can also drop in the comment section below so the next thing you do is you click on wallet.py so click on wallet.py wait for it to load up so once it loads up you ask you um to sign in with your pi account you open your pi so now once you download this app and you come up to this page what you do is you go back to your pi app that's the pi network app you go back to it so once you go back here and it opens up so once you go up, go back to your pi network app then you click on the pi browser to open it right? once you then you click on sign into pi browser click on so stick with me and make sure you can write this down too if you don't get it okay so so it's supposed to like open up your 
Uh huh. So you're here. Sorry, sorry. Let's let's go back against the woman. Go back here. Sorry, go back to your Pi browser. And then you click on the side side menu. Click on side menu. Then you click on Pi browser. By browser. Then install. So once you access your Pi browser through the side menu in your Pi network app, um, it will bring you to a page like this. So on this page, what you do is click on wallet.py. So once you click on wallet.py, then so then you click on. So once you then you click on generate wallet. So once you generate your wallet, right? I'm sorry about the background noise. There's the, they're doing a little bit of construction close to where I am. So once you generate your wallet, you receive hundred test pi. So that test pi is what you use to test your mobile app. That's the mobile wallet app by sending and receiving test pi. Okay. Just make note that your test pi is not the same with the pi you have mined. All right. They are different. This is just for you to use to test the pi wallet. All right. The pi mobile wallet. So let's continue. So then you click on generate. So once you click on generate wallet, your wallet will be created and you'll be given um, uh, some phrase words, all right? Some, so is it, I think 12 phrase words, which you're supposed to copy and save, all right? Make sure you keep it safe, all right? Because it will be what you'll be using, you use to assess your wallet in the future. Make sure you don't lose it. They are very important. And you can also, you, you, um, on that same page, you see where you can link your fingerprints to your wallet. Guys, use it to unlock your wallet. If you're phone uses a uh, fingerprint all right so once you do that i'll bring you to this page so on this page you'll be able to see your 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 your, your wallet address all right so this is your pi wallet address okay so once they give you that you can copy this too and keep safe all right um so this is what you be you, you use to test your wallet address your 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 wallet address uh, this is what you used to test your mobile app so you though you can send and receive test pi on this i repeat test pi is not the same as your the pi you have mined all right so once you do this um you click on continue that's you can copy your wallet address and keep somewhere if you want then do not do anything or just click on continue so once you click on continue we load up and show you this so once it shows you this you click on confirm that is you want to get notifications from other pioneers then you click on confirm so once you click on confirm you will see something like this so now all that's left is for you to test that you send and receive to test the mobile app i right? make sure you do that i'll be dropping my wallet address in the description below you can send your you can test you can test your your, your wallet by sending some pi to me they are just test pi don't worry they are test pi it's not like you're sending your pi to me they are test pi it's just for you to use and test your wallet and i would advise you do that all right because it counts it's very important you should test your wallet by sending and receiving test pi but if you know anybody that has done this you can send and receive be between you guys all right but if you don't know any of dropping my wallet address you can send pi to me all right and um how you can you can do that all right okay so now as you can see important note they say test pi is not a real pi that you have mined through the pi app okay test pi is solely for purpose of testing transactions on the pi testnet and does not contain any value right so the pi testnet will periodically reset as part of the testing which will also reset your test pi balance all right so that's it okay so that is just it the test pi is not your real pi so there's no need to be alarmed so this is basically how you create your wallet so now let me show you how you can send and receive so to send your test pi to test your pass wallet so once you click on send then you copy the wallet address i'll be dropping you come here and paste it here so once you send you paste it here then paste in the amount of pi you want to send all right so this is the minimum the fee then you click on send all right you click on send 
so if you're out of test pi you can still re you can request for 100 test pi again to keep you to use to test more if you want all right so test pi is not real pi doesn't have value so to receive you come here you copy this is to receive this is the wallet address you send to whoever wants to send you pi all right so you come here you copy the wallet address and share it with your friends and family to receive test pi from them so basically that's how you create your pi wallet and guys it's not really too late to start mining your pi all right because pi will be listing soon and it's estimated to list at about 200 dollars per pi so imagine you have 1000 dollars or so you have mined like 1000 pi or so and it's listed at 200 dollars each that is easy that's easy 200 thousand dollars worth of pi all right so this is actually great so don't miss out on this opportunity all right so do that now so um so i think that's been that brings us to the end of this video if you have any questions or if there's anything you don't get you can drop it in the comment section below and i'll reply and um feel free, i'm dropping the link to my telegram channel and my whatsapp group in the description below you can join there for more for more to learn more or if you want to contact me directly for any assistance all right so and i repeat okay so um so that's basically all for today thanks for watching this is crypto airdropper don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notification to receive more updates so see you in my next video peace